Hi everyone, I'm Rebecca. I'm from Adani, Australia. We've been getting job number questions coming through thick and fast over the past week, so I just wanted to take some time to talk to you about job numbers on the Carmichael project. And this is particularly relevant right now because we've recently announced that we'll be building a coal mine that produces 27.5 million tonnes of coal each year, as opposed to the original 60 million tonne per annum coal mine that was proposed. In line with that announcement, we also explain that we'll gradually construct and ramp up to 27.5 million tonnes per annum. So that means that we won't need to invest as much up front to start the mine. So what does this then mean for our job numbers? Previously, we've stated that the Carmichael project will create more than 10,000 direct and indirect jobs. Now, this number related to the construction and the operation of the mine, the rail, and the port project if the mine was operating at 60 million tonnes per annum. So how about now? During the initial construction and ramp up of the Carmichael project, there will be 1,500 jobs for people directly working on the mine and rail, and an additional 6,750 jobs in supporting industries are expected. So these supporting jobs are for people like engineers, office workers, truck drivers, scientists, cafe workers, waste removalists, the list goes on. So that's approximately 8,250 jobs expected in the first phase of the Carmichael project. But how did we come to that number? Adani Mining has done modelling on the direct jobs for the mine and the rail. And we have also used the same economic forecasting advice tools that is used by the Queensland Resources Council. And they engage specialists in economic modelling to measure the economic impact of the Queensland mining industry. Critically, all these jobs are all new jobs that didn't exist before, many of which will go to regional Queensland communities like Rockhampton, Townsville, Mackay, and the Isaac region where the mine will be based. The other thing to note is that these new jobs aren't coming at the expense of jobs elsewhere in Australia, as we'll be selling into new markets for Australian coal. Now, we made commitments in previous years that our primary source for employees will come from the communities of Townsville and Rockhampton. We will continue to honour that commitment, and we look forward to working with Townsville and Rockhampton as we move forward with the Carmichael project. And also, really importantly, our mine will use the same conventional coal mining techniques and equipment that's used in other Queensland coal mines. That means that people, not robots, will be driving the trucks, operating the excavators, fixing the engines in the workshops, cooking the meals, maintaining the conveyor belts, and a whole lot more. We are about real jobs for real people. I hope that answers your questions about the Carmichael project and jobs. If you have any other questions, of course, feel free to send them to us via our social media channels or you can get more information from adaniaustralia.com.